What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to Fandom United. My name is Gio, and I'm doing it. I'm giving in. I'm going to watch the latest trailer for The Matrix Resurrections. People have told me that a lot of stuff gets revealed. Chances are I already know a lot of that stuff that is revealed. I'm somebody who follows the rumors, the theories online and whatnot. I mean, hell, Toby and Andrew being in No Way Home. I mean, that's That's like other breaking news. Water is wet. But if you're ready, let's check out the Matrix Resurrections, see what these reveals are all about, and uh, share our thoughts afterwards. Here we go. We can't see it, but we're all trapped inside these strange repeating loops. It's a familiar shot. Billions of people just that was from living Reloaded. out their lives. Oblivious. Is he Asia Smith? But this is the moment. Where's Hugo? We need to show us what is real. Wow. He's back. He's back in the Matrix. I remember this. Woo! So deja vu. And yet it's obviously all wrong. Maybe this isn't the story we think it is. They taught you good. Made you believe their world was all you deserved. God, the visuals and cinematography. And some part of you knew that was a lie. Some part of you remembered what was real. It's so easy <laughs> to forget how much noise the Matrix pumps into your head. Something else makes the same kind of noise. Is that Jada? War. Hey, Niobe. Niobe. What happens to Nia? Mr. Oh, no about that. The most important choice in Neo's life. It's not his to make. You're gonna see Bianca Chopper kick some ass? my turn to believe in her. Part of me feels like I have been waiting my whole life for you. If you want to see Trinity again, fight for her! Wow. It's a love story. I saw this in a dream. Oh man. She is reborn. My dream ended here. Oh man. We still know Kung Fu. <laughs> nice. Woo! After all these years, back to the Matrix. I can't wait. I'm excited. Okay, I, I'm like you. I'm crossing my fingers, hoping the story is great. Um, I actually read uh, a couple days ago about Lena Wachowski and how Warner Brothers tried to like get you know a sequel made happening, something a fourth movie. And um, it took the loss of Lana's parents and one sleepless night to finally figure out the story. And it just, man, like, the, so it's very personal. And uh, you can kind of see it here um, just with a relationship between Trinity and, and Neo and Neo fighting so hard to get her to come back. I mean, this movie has some explaining to do that much is uh, certain. We've seen the glimpses, the teases of how they're going to treat the original trilogy and you know what that will all mean in resurrections. But going back to Hugo weaving for a second, I just, I don't know about this guy as uh, I guess the, the agent Smith, you know, um, 
it's like take a movie like X-Men Days of Future Past and you got Sir Patrick Stewart coming back as Professor Xavier. But then somebody else who's not named Sir Ian McKellen playing Magneto. It's like, you get what I mean? It just, I, I don't know. We'll see how it works. Okay. Um, the Yaya Abdul-Mateen as a young Morpheus. That makes sense. Big fan of the actor. Don't even know who that guy is who's playing Agent Smith. So that also plays a role in how I feel personally about it. Um, and Jada Pinkett Smith as Niobe. Looking a little different. Uh, that tells me lots of time has passed in the real world. And that's how long Neo Trinity have been trapped. Because remember, the machines, they got Neo's body. They took it after he defeated uh, Agent Smith. Did he die? I mean, if we're going by MCU logic, you know, that, that could easily not be the case. But nevertheless, we will find out in two weeks. I got my tickets, The Matrix Resurrections. Can't wait to talk about it on here. You guys, thank you so much for joining me on this trailer reaction. Give a thumbs up and subscribe. I got stuff going on in 2022 with this channel, and I would love for you to be a part of it. Thank you so much again for your time, for your subscriptions. And until next time, catch you guys later.